12 News continues our investigation into allegations of bullying by softball coaches at Mississippi Valley State. Yesterday, we told you about Valley softball player complaints. Well, tonight, 12 News' Gary Burton Jr. spoke with a parent of a player who also spoke out about the alleged bullying. He joins us now. Gary? Patrick Tuya's daughter played softball for the Mississippi Valley, and he says that he takes responsibility for not speaking up as a parent, saying that he's heard about and seen actions from the Valley coaches that were wrong. I should have been there. I, sh I should have done something sooner. With watery eyes, Patrick Tuya, a high school football coach, feels he failed his daughter and her softball teammates at Mississippi Valley, as he expressed on Twitter. Multiple players have shared their stories on social media, saying the treatment from Coach Lee Smith and Brittany Tillery led some players to depression and suicidal thoughts. You suck. Um, you're fat. That's why you can't get down. You need to lose weight. Um, if you don't like what I'm doing, let's take it out in the parking lot. These are verbally abusive words Tuya's daughter says the coaches would use. His daughter quit playing softball completely in 2018. She loved that game. It, um, sorry, it bothers me. When you see the love taken away from something that... Uh, your kid enjoy it. He says one of the worst things he saw was when players weren't allowed to talk to their parents after a game. And then when you try to go approach your, your own daughter and she looks at you like, no, no, don't, don't come, you know, because she knows that there's a repercussion for me wanting to talk to her because the whole thing is you don't talk to your parents. Just get in line and go to the bus. As a coach and a parent, Tuya says there was a fine line that he couldn't decide how to handle this issue. I'm very proud of these girls, and I also want to apologize to them that I didn't do my part as a coach who knows that there's, that wasn't the right things to do or that's not how you coach. And according to the university's coordinator of athletic media and public relations, all these allegations are under investigation. And I tried to get in contact with Coach Smith and Tillery for comment, but both calls went unanswered. I'm Gary Burton, Jr. Back to you.